If you have 14 minutes today, you can get your back stronger. I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Hi, I'm your coach, Daniel. Welcome back to DH Fitness. Today, we're just gonna set the clock for 14 minutes. It's not a lot of time, but it's just the perfect amount to start developing a stronger back. All you're going to need is one dumbbell. Our first movement today is going to be a good morning movement, and it's gonna utilize an additional weight. Today, I'm using something small, with whatever weight you have available at home or wherever you're doing this workout, ask yourself it's, if it's the appropriate weight for your abilities at this point and make the adjustment accordingly. Start with the good morning. I'm going to demonstrate a couple reps of this movement. Hugging the weight against your chest, I'm gonna have one leg forward, one leg back. This is a staggered position for the good morning stretch or the uh, exercise. Front knee is barely bent and the back foot is very light as far as weight goes. Most of this weight, most of my body's weight is focused on this front leg. Same thing on the other side. I would switch my feet, hold the weight right where it is. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Today's reps are going to be five, only five reps of each of these movements. Movement two is a suitcase deadlift holding the dumbbell right by your side like you would a suitcase. With your feet directly underneath your hips, slight bend in the knee, we're gonna push our hips back and trace the side of our body with the dumbbell. Similar to the good morning, except now our feet are together and the weight is loaded to the side of our body. After I do five reps there, I would do the same thing on the other side as I am showing now. And then your third movement is a sumo deadlift with your feet just beyond the width of your shoulders. Slide bend of the knee again, pushing your hip back to reach the dumbbell towards the floor. Again, this is going to be five reps as well. Strengthening our back also means that we need to strengthen our entire posterior chain. Your low back, your glutes, and your hamstrings, and that's what we're gonna focus on today. Lower body movements that focus on helping us develop a stronger back. As we move through this hinge pattern of leaning over and bending from the hip, our back is what keeps the weight in its place as we move through these exercises. Three movements today and getting our back strong, 14 minutes is all you need. Great, let's set 10 seconds to start. We're starting with our first movement, the staggered stance good morning using an additional weight today. Five reps for every movement. And begin. Five reps on this side. Keep your shoulder blades pinched back and your back flat as you move through this. Focus on loading the front leg. Back foot is very light on tension. Right. Feet directly underneath the hips, dumbbell off to the side. Suitcase deadlift, five on each side. Trace the side of your legs with this weight. And we don't need to touch the dumbbell all the way to the ground. Same thing on the other side. And this side arm, although it has no weight, I'm still holding tension in that side. Helps me to feel balanced with this single loaded movement, single side loaded movement. D 
deep breath at the top, hold it. And on the way up, we exhale. Let's go wide stance for our sumo deadlift. This one, I'm gonna try to reach the dumbbell to the floor. Let's go back to the good mornings. Roll on the way down. Case deadlift. Yeah, I feel it in my back because you're trying to maintain this flat back position as you lean over. Good. Other side. I really feel these guys down here working. Also, our upper back and keeping our shoulders back and not slouching forward on the way down. Sumo deadlift. go back into our first movement the good morning this is set number three and try to hold the weight at chest level You need to take longer breaks between these sets or even the movements themselves. No problem, you can absolutely do that. You can pause the video if you'd like or just do as much as you can in our allotted time of 14 minutes today. deadlift. Stands for our sumo deadlifts again. Coming up on halfway there.
thoughtful movement as we go through each repetition. again set number four take a little breather here Excellent work, everyone. We're getting there. Really feel that loading in the entire backside of the leg during these sumo deadlifts. Four minutes left. Let's see if we can get through one more. I have to really focus now on making sure I'm not resting too much of my weight on that back foot. A lift. Take a little breather.
the good morning. Last two minutes, less than two minutes. Really focus on my balance now. So that's 45 seconds, guys. Made it. Well done, everyone. Woo! That one got pretty sweaty. So just three movements that we're focusing on today in developing our back. And when we think about the back again, it's an entire system of musculature and awareness that needs to be there so that we can really prove to say that we have a strong back. Well done, everyone. I hope you enjoyed that workout. Again, 14 minutes, not a lot of time. We're gonna need to continue to do this over a longer period of time in uh, an increasing in weight, repetition, or time. So choose the path or the journey that you're on. Thanks so much for joining me. We'll see you guys soon.